This is video two of three in a series that show you how to manage client testimonials. In this video, we're going to change the settings, reorder and style our quotes. Then in video three, we're gonna show you how to actually plug in the testimonials into your site. Now, if you watched the first video, you'll have seen us create this set of quotes that we're now going to configure for this set. Let's view the quotes that we created last time. Now, for some particular reason, we've decided that the order of the quotes isn't quite right. Now, changing the order is pretty straightforward. All you have to do is roll your mouse over the small hamburger icon, grab it by clicking and keeping your left mouse button down, and then moving the quote to a different order. And you can do this over and again until you're happy with the order of the quotes. Now, you may have noticed that as soon as we drop quote into a new order, a big red update quote order button appears. It's important that we click this if we want to save this new order. Don't click the red order button and the new order will not be saved. Editing an individual quote is super easy too. Just click the blue edit this quote button and you'll see the original panel appear again. Then all we have to, all we have to do is make some changes and click the update button and we'll see the changes are reflected straight away. So now we have our content right, what about the style? Let's go back to the original summary table and we'll see that the style that we've currently got is accordion darker with icon. So let's choose something different. The easiest way to view styles is to click the green preview button and this renders all the quotes that we've created so far inside our website. To change the style, just click this little drop down and choose different styles until you found one that you like. There are quite a few to choose from. Once you've found one that you like, all you have to do is go back to testimonials. And that's how simple it is to edit the quotes and change the style on your testimonials. I hope that's helped and please make sure to watch the last video in this series, which explains how to actually plug in this testimonial into any web page on your site. Many thanks.